Hops. I love it. Yeah, right? It was... It's not... It's bad, but it's not that terrible, honestly. Repair. Especially if you can just repair it with this easy peasy learn spell. Now where is the rest? There's something. Repair. There we go. Everything's as good as new. Nice, nice. They surprisingly really didn't do more damage. That was... Rebellion. Glad Drax Wizardware. Founded in 1750 and with locations in Paris, London and Hogsmeade, Gladrax offers a variety of wizarding garments and accessories. Mr. Augustus Hill and his associate Otto Dibble happily help all those who wander into the shop, enjoying in particular the challenge of the customer with less fashion sense the most. Is it inside? Yeah. We were just talking about you. Oh, that's why I couldn't talk to him before, maybe. Hello, sir, I don't believe we've met. Yeah, yeah, that's why I couldn't interact with him. Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. Extraordinaire. Your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. Clothes. Rags, wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. Mm -hmm. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Sure. Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. <laughs> Thank you. I don't need it. I already have that. Preview gear. I'd say that looks as if it was made for you. Oh, uh, okay. Well, thank you. I'll take it. You won't be disappointed. That's a glad... What? You received a new time to equip it. Seriously? <laughs> Yeah, I got, I got that. Select the cloaks. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, what is this? Ooh. Oh my god, this is beautiful. Couldn't even finish speaking. 31. I'm not gonna buy anything because, like, we seem to find enough gear. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. What an extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeade. Right. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butter beer. Shall we head to the three broomsticks? Sounds like a good idea. Wonderful. Just down this way then. Yeah, wait a second. I need to nice. unequip this stuff because it's worse than what I had originally. <laughs> Give me a second. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Thanks. Come on. Assuming it is not too busy, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She is a charming hostess and a powerful witch. Good one to know. Uh, oh god. <laughs> All of a sudden I started to run. <gasps> a cylinder. That's either Professor Layton, the greatest gentleman of London. Or an evil guy. You, said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. What? That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. He's very mad. He's like, God damn it. You failed me. This child. What are you not telling me? Hello, I'm the child. All you need to know is that if you cannot. Is get that dude the in the background supposed to be no here? To or is he just standing there? Usually. Oh. <laughs> Let's go. Why am I breathing so hard? Did they see us? Yes. I don't think so. What was that called? What do you mean I don't think so? Vanrock is working with Rookwood. Two R's. From the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Ooh. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Yeah, that's gonna help us. 
Okay. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. What? Thank you, Serona. You be well. Hello. No. What we're fleeing. Oh. There's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. That's nice. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Mm. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one, single-handedly took down a troll. Mm -hmm. Is that right? Well done. <laughs> she, they don't sound that ex excited. Like, well then, in Hogsmeade, that's never happened before. It is strange, I know. The only brutes we usually have to deal with. Are... Uh oh, just don't, don't turn around. If we can't see them, they can't see us. <laughs> Was that Lodgog I saw leaving just now? Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Who the fuck are you? Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. Ha! Ah! Burn! Are you Theophilus? Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. What the fuck do you want? My friend is enjoying a well earned butter beer. Only want a quick word. I didn't even get to drink. Oh! <laughs> I said. My friend is busy. Damn, son. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Everyone's like, nah, nah, man. Come the That's other. a community right there. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. We don't need Can't your galleons. butter beer forever. Oh. <laughs> uh. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. I don't even know who that is! Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. But like, who troll, is that? Ranrock and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? Why? It's not I my fault I everything. defeated them. But it's perhaps best I do that later. Some quests have opened. Now might be a good time to head back to the castle. Quests? <laughs> I need quests. Let's set a person for the map to track your own locations. Rebellion. Anything of interest in here? I mean, there's a, there's upstairs. There's still something flying around outside. Ha! The three broomsticks. Blah, 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 broomsticks. Currently run by Serona Ryan and allegedly as old as Hogsmeade itself, the Three Broomsticks is a long-standing gathering spot for villagers and Hogwarts students who want to enjoy butterbeer or fire whiskey. The heck is a butterbeer anyway? Um, I don't see any. It said I have new quests, but there's nothing. I'll look at that further when I talk to her. All right. I am certainly glad Serona was there. And that she isn't intimidated by thugs like Brookwood and Harlow. I want to understand what's going on, and I hope you will tell me. But for the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. I don't want her to worry. Yeah, that would be terrible. You must return to your common room for the night. Access the map. Select the Hogwarts map button. Okay, it, I would have just pressed left, but it didn't let me. Fast travel to your common room. Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I was like, can I even do that? It looked so great. <sighs> Did I sleep already? Is it the next day?
Okay. <sighs> Back at Hogwarts. Whew! You have received an owl post. Read mail. Open field guide. All right. All puzzles and characters you've met have requested updates for you. Come and see me. I've discovered something in the locket we found at Gringotts. You didn't even tell me where. We found a locket. <laughs> did we? We did. We found a locket. Ghost. Hello there. Perhaps you can help. Hello. Were you calling me? I was, yes. I was. Perhaps a fellow Hufflepuff might have the perseverance to join me in a bit of an adventure. Sure. Following a treasure map, to be precise. Slight respite from battling the odd troll, I should think. Asked Poppy if she'd be interested as well, but couldn't drag her away from her puff scheme. Puff scheme, yeah, sure. Okay, right. Both leading to locations around Hogwarts. Care to have a look at one? Following a Hogwarts treasure map. <laughs> what Count is me it in. doing in the background? It's like, ah! It fascinates me. Yeah. You can keep whatever treasure lies at the end of your map. I'll be satisfied just knowing where it leads. Oh, cool, there. Yeah. Any idea what to where start? Where do you suggest I search first? Hmm. Based on a cursory review of your map, I'd suggest somewhere near Hecate's classroom. Hecate's. All right. Very well. I shall take a look if I can find the time. Fair enough. Meet me back Fair here enough. if you find anything. Ooh. Okay, I have to accio this. And... I don't know. There's this thing outside. Yeah, I feel like I know that. Ooh. Can you help us? Professor, do you have time to chat? I always have time for my students. How may I help you? Hmm. I wondered if I might ask how long you've been teaching at Hogwarts. Well, it's been what now? <laughs> Seven swift years. Time does fly because we have fun. Essential, in my opinion. <laughs> because An we have eager, fun. An eager, positive, and confident mind is the most open to knowledge, I find. Some of the professors may not agree with your approach. <laughs> well, each of us has our own style, I suppose. Mm. Some in the teaching field believe that hard work and dedication are the only keys to success. But they forget what drives those things. If one cannot fathom why some would expend energy on gobstones, then one is blind to the enormous power of play. <laughs> and that's why you teach the way you do. Precisely. I strive to be the sort of professor that I would have enjoyed in school. Aww. My experience was less cheerful. Aww. I'm sorry to hear that, sir. It sounds as if your experience as a student was less than ideal. Had I received a more traditional education, well, enough about my student days. You are here now, and it would be a shame if you didn't enjoy it. I'll mm -hmm. do my best, Professor. Thank you for the advice. You are most welcome. <laughs> uh, try to have a bit of fun today. <laughs> right, thank you, Professor. I think it's up here, especially since we can't. Does it open it? The first clue shows a rhinoceros. I know I must have walked by it at least a dozen times now, if only I could remember where it is. Um. Yeah. Well, we can solve this now. Three, two, we need a two. A two was the. Seeker, that thing, and we need a um, unicorn for. So it's a five. Fünf, sieben is that weird thing. Ta-da! 
I destroyed it. Revelio. I I searched. Cool. Revelio. Someone's brewing a potion in here. Students really if you can. Talking mirror? <sighs> Professor Fig, as if my schedule wasn't congested enough, the ministry has charged me with arranging the rather inconvenient arrival of a new student at Hogwarts. A fifth year, if you can't believe. Professor Weasley insists that they will need an escort and a mentor to help them acclim acclimatize. Acclim acclimatize. Acclim acclimatize. Yeah, I know, but before term begins, I have assigned the task to you. Please see Professor Weasley for details. 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 Professor Phineas Nicholas Bell, the Black Headmaster. Blah, 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 blah. Having a hard time reading. Just too excited. Nothing here. Revelio. I don't believe that for a second. Yeah, that's where the quest is gonna be. I was like, wait a minute. It's his classroom. Oopsie, sorry. Wait, no, we're not going to. We're gonna do the side quests first. This seems like the right place, huh? Ah, a rhinoceros skeleton. I'm on the right track. Revelio. Now what? Accio. Obala. Repairer. Well, okay, I found it. That's it. Find the second landmark. Okay. That's it. I just had to find it. Okay, cool. That There's the be. fountain. Yeah. I'm getting closer. The Dedalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? You have a different side quest. Now I have to find the third one. It seems from uh, once I've exited the court, it should look for a stairwell going up. The stairwell looks promising. Lumos. Mm -hmm. Okay. Revelio. This looks like the portrait from the map. And where's the treasure? Well, I can see it. Now I just have to act Whoa! Uh, there was a doorway hidden within the portrait. I wonder what came of Arthur's search. The Dedalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? Sure, I have no idea what this is. Is everything all right? Yes, I'm sorry. I'm just... I'm Nelly, by the way. I'm just so excited that the Dedalian keys are back. The what keys? The Dedalian <laughs> the what keys. keys. Surely you've seen them flying about. Um... The rumor is that a former headmistress, Professor Mole, conjured them to protect the contents of certain locked cabinets years ago. Professor Black couldn't be bothered to disenchant the keys, and they appear every few years. Okay. You should try to catch one. Why would I do that? <laughs> Why would I do that? will lead you to a locked cabinet somewhere in the castle. If you can manage to get the key into the cabinet lock, not an easy task, you may find a reward. Uh-huh. Why would Professor Mole conjure flying keys? What I heard is that it had something to do with keeping peeves out of things. But that may or may not be true. He's a poltergeist. <laughs> I thought they could go almost anywhere. Surely you will be trying to complete the challenge as well. Ah, uh, I've tried, and I can't even get past the first cabinets. Perhaps you'll have better luck. 
I'd love to know what's in the cabinets. I mean, I look into it. Perhaps I'll give it a go. I hope you do. In fact, I think I heard one of the keys in the astronomy tower. You should listen for them. Is that the weird noise I, I hear sometimes? I hope you follow sometimes? a few keys at least. If you manage to open a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find, if anything. Could you remind me how the Dedalian keys work again? Just wondering. When you spot or hear a flying key, you're to follow it back to its cabinet. Inserting it in the lock is the tricky part. I hope you follow some. If you open a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find, if anything. Um, okay. We're gonna go to him first and tell him we did it. Let's tell him how awesome we were. Hi, what have you dude. Hello, Arthur. Thought you might like to know that my map led to a doorway hidden within a portrait. Oh, how clever. Mine led to the boathouse. Barely found the treasure before I saw the headmaster coming. Mm. He shooed me out of there, but not before I got a few galleons richer. What did you find? I found what I believe is an authentic historian's uniform. Oh, that's lucky. Seems as though we both had success. <laughs> Glad I enlisted you to join me. Well, Hooray. on to the next Hogwarts mystery. Wonder That's a different a game. Rummage round Weasley's office might yield anything interesting. We have the most annoying of all the prefects, I swear. <laughs> it's like I don't like the prefects, my god. Oh, that's really cool. Rebellion. That's a romantic spot. It's very cute. I mean, everyone can walk through here, but. Hello. Who are you? <laughs> he tries to make him dance. Okay, sure. Man. My dear Satyavati, <laughs> Satyavati, you'll be pleased to hear that I received word from my contacts at Cambridge who conceded that they had in fact been incorrect in their understanding of meteor showers. It seems that as an uh, it seems that an Irish astronomer and a British astronomer both built upon the work done by an Italian astronomer or muggles, mind you, as far as I know, to propose calculating the position of the dust at Earth's orbit as means of connecting meteors to comets. Brilliant, really. One can only imagine what they might do with an enchanted telescope. Thank you. Frustratingly, in my correspondence, I did feel that I had to continue using the pseudonym from my days as a gentleman scholar. Whilst I still find it rather exciting to have a secret identity, the reason irks me. I'm so looking forward to our trip later this year to Janta Manta. What an adventure we shall have. I miss you, dear sister. And I do hope you are well. With love, Sukrita. Sukrita? I have no idea. That is... I apologize if I said these names wrong, which I definitely did, but I never heard of these before. No idea how to pronounce them. A Dedalian key. I wonder where it might lead me. Can I just... I'm just curious because if I'm already here, I've taken to studying during the day and I want to see where Rebellion. I am. Oh look, Lumos. Telescope. Hmm. Whoa. Wow. Rebellion. <laughs> wow. Spell. Gorgeous. Hello. If I don't look at it directly, astronomy telescope. 
This teleco bleh, telescope is the finest stargazing instrument of its kind, perfect for viewing uh, viewing the moon and the stars and anything else on one might find in the night sky. Can I look at it? No. Lumos. Oh, that's someone flying. I was like, what the hell? Revelio. Lumos. Thank you. Now let's try to find the key. I just wonder where it went. I don't know where it is. <laughs> it didn't fall. Eh? <laughs> Handy resource indeed, your field guide. Rebellion. Ah, oh, those are the cabinets, aren't they? There's the cabinet. How do I get this key in there? Slap. <laughs> what? Okay. Oh, I have to wait. Well, go to the left. Yes. <laughs> it's just slapping. An old coin. Perhaps Nelly knows what it means. House token. <laughs> he just slapped the shit out of it. <laughs> this is great. Oh my god. It's just like, fudge. All right, all right. Hey, I found Were you able it. to I follow one of the Dedalian keys? Yes. Hello, Nelly. I managed to get a Dedalian key into its lock. Brilliant. What did you find in the cabinet? A curious token of some sort. Looks like some sort of house token. I bet it unlocks house chests. I call them house chests. I've seen the one in Gryffindor and heard they're also in the other common rooms as well. Keep an eye out. I do okay. hope you continue on. For so much effort, the prize must be something grand. Well, I... I should see this through and find the Hufflepuff house chest. I sure hope so. But for that, I will just... floofly over there because, Jesus. I'm not walking all this... Nope. Distance. It's right around the corner. This must be my house ah. chest. I just need to insert the token. Seems I'll need to find more house tokens if I'm to open this. Ah. Quite a few by the look of it. Okay. So anyway, if we, if we got all of them, we can do magic. Find the remaining house tokens around Hogwarts. Okay, so that's one of the biggest side quests. 